Hello and welcome back to The Colony with Man of the Answer. Today we are taking a look at Vertigo Remastered. So first of all, I should say a massive, massive thank you to the wonderful indie who gifted me this game. That's in preparation because Vertigo 2 is out hopefully sometime this year, although it's only got about another month left and there's no fixed release date as far as I'm aware. If you recall, I did play a demo of Vertigo 2 last year, about June, July, I think it was. It's been a little while since we even played that demo and it was very, very promising. So I'm definitely going to play Vertigo 2. So it does seem sensible that I play Vertigo 1 to actually know what's going on, to have some semblance of an idea of what is going on. So it was quite weird as well, wasn't it? I thought I said I could continue then and that would have been weird as well since I've never played the game but we shall hit new game and we shall jump into Vertigo. I should also say, as all my videos start now, an apology <laughs> to Indy, because it has taken me a couple of months to get to uh, to get around to this. But I am very close to catching up with my backlog now, so only one or two more videos and then the apologies end and we can just move on with our lives as if nothing ever happened. <laughs> Just I believe, as that insinuated there, this is actually a game developed by one person, which is very impressive. Same with the sequel, obviously, as well. Bye, cat. What a cute little car. I wonder what the number plate means. Obviously, it looks like uh, the developer's initials. Oh, we're straight there, look. Thumbstick to move, so it does have a smooth movement and smooth rotation, which I've obviously put up to the maximum speed because why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? It does have some comfort options like snap rotation, teleportation, and... I know you don't have any reception in the valley, so I assume you'll get this message once you get some altitude closer to my cabin. Uh... You know, I don't believe in any oh. supernatural stuff, but there's been uh, even more weird shit happening in town since you left. Not quite sure what you expect to find up there, but there's clearly something going on. Hmm. Clearly. Try to be careful. Oh, I stocked a bunch of firewood last time I was up there. Light a fire so you don't freeze to death. Will do. Call me if you find anything, okay? Thanks, Ben. Okay. See ya. Took me a little while to figure out where that was coming from. I thought it was he, the developer, had done very well with doing the um, audio placement because it sounded like it's coming from the same place, whichever direction I came from. So I initially thought the developer was very bad at audio, but I will take that back. I wonder, can we get into options from here? Doesn't look like can it, because I'm already a little bit annoyed with the, uh, the hand-based directional movement. I should have changed that to head-based. My bad. Oop. Something weird happened there. That key doesn't go in that lock. That's not the right kind of key. Whole game's a sham. Does the phone do anything? Was my hand that wiry before? Was I always so skinny? Oh, hello. It's me. Hello, me. Oh, I haven't got, I can't do a thumbs up. Can't do a thumbs up. It does have index controller support though, look, which is quite impressive. Obviously this is the remastered version, so that must have been added in with the remastered stuff, but no thumbs up. No thumbs up. Nil point. So we can't get in there, as I still don't have the key on me. Or don't still have the key on me, I should say. We have a book. The Many Worlds... Interpretation? Does that say interpretation? Or is that just... It just doesn't really work in my head. I can't, I don't know why interpret, yeah, it just, just says interpretation. I don't know why that was so weird to me. What a beautiful house. What a beautiful place to live. Imagine that being your morning view. I mean, obviously, if that was actually your view, you'd be freaked out because it's animated, but imagine this was real and then that was your morning view. Wouldn't that just be amazing? Just sat there at your couch. TV's in the wrong position. You don't want to have your couch there and your TV there. That's mad. None of the chairs are facing the TV. Good start. Good start. Wow, that's some flammable wood. That just went up like nobody's business. Hello. Oh, goodbye. And now it's night time and the fire sounds like it's died down, but it's still a roaring inferno. Something's happening. Something's happening. 
Okay. Uh, I don't like that that's just heading towards me. That, that's not a good thing, right? We don't want that. Uh, 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 run. Oh, it's like little, little snakes slithering past me. Oh, and into my face. <laughs> Your arm is not connected, mate. What? Did you just take my soul? Well, you gave it back, I suppose. That's nice of you. What? Well, just look at that. What a weird character design. This is what I liked about the Vertigo 2 demo. It just seems just a bit out there, a bit surreal, a bit odd. And just generally quite interesting. See, what just happened there? That's, that's, it's not normal, is it? What's going on? Oh, oh, hello. I kind of like the blurring around the edge of the vision there to uh, show you that you're sort of waking up. Who's he talking to? We have a space-time manipulator. Is that what I have to make? Do I have to make a space-time manipulator? I can't reach you. You've gone too far. It doesn't break, which is something, I suppose. We can't pick that up. Or that. Or that. Well, I guess we don't have to do anything with them. And we shall again move on with our lives. Nothing in the drawers. What is the purpose of this room with this massively heavily gated door? And then just something you can just climb up over with all the furniture in the room. Yeah. And did not go so well for you, did it? Okay. Recording? Recording. Space Time Manipulator Devlog 233. The date is October 18th, 2015. They moved evac to next week, so I've had to accelerate testing. Uh-huh. I've been refining the exotic fields in the bulb, though, and the simulations say it's stable enough for human trials. I realize now the door was for this room, not for that room. So long as I don't teleport into a wall or something. Still reliant on the reactor's quantum juice, so the more of that I can get my hands on, the better. All right. Here goes nothing. Ah! Oh my God! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. So I guess that's now ours. Give me that. Recording. Recording. Space time manipulator devlog 233. The date is October 18th, 2015. Oh, I like that. I like that. It's a bit like, uh, is it budget cuts? You can look around the area you're about to teleport into and then you bring it into your face to teleport. That's, that's nice. I like that a lot. So let's, uh, let's head up there then. Whoop. Many multiverse classifications. A cunabulus, home sweet home. Exoproximal. May have an alternate history. Xenoproximal. Major evolutionary divergence. Xenoconsimilar. Geologically divergent. Radically different. Skull harmonic. Celestially divergent. Earth may or may not exist, often in a different orbit. And then skull disharmonic. Relati reality divergent. Laws of physics and structure of space may vary radically. No chance of Earth existing. 
Well, that sounds terrifying. So, what have we got? Is there a reason that was lit up so, uh... Oh, I see. That's cool. So we need a key card for that. Do you have a key card, I wonder? Inconvenient, of course, but I like that carried on from where it was rather than starting again. Big fan of that. Still trying to uphold the deal. For now, at least. Sector 12 now. Not my finest residence, but I am right next door to an old associate of mine. Prawl. So, that's nice. That is nice. I'm trying to prioritize projects. It's nice to have friends. It's clear I'm going to spend way more time developing the space-time manipulator if I want it functional by fall. Okay. What is it? I don't know. What does Plank use? Is this it? Classified. Why does it seem to leak out of all the walls in the reactor? Well, probably cheap pump. Oh. Oh, okay. So let's pop into options straight away and do head orientation. And you can see the rest of the uh, the comfort mode is down, seated mode is off, smooth, fast. Uh, it's just difficulty options, nothing too much, and then just a general preset graphics thing. Let's have a look at upgrades. Teleport range. Oh, we did it. We did it. So what's that? That was double press. Double press, yes. The important thing is that it seems to be a vital power source whoop, 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 whoop. more... Oh, I like that as well, actually. And that. Well, that sounds dangerous, if you ask me. Can I go in there? No. So what's the extra... extra distance for? Did he definitely not have a key card on him? Okay. How long has he been there as well? Can't see a key card on his uh, person. If I was a key card, where would I be? Swipe my phone. Nope, weirdly, it is not swipe your phone. Hmm. Oh, the door is open. The door is open. Does that mean this door opens? Nope. Just that door. Yes. Nope. Oh, uh, you're not Brian. No. They gave me the wrong room. Uh, sorry, we had a no show at evacuation, and it's my job to locate employees. They said this guy was last locked being in this lab. He, he was. So I've been waiting here for, oh, it's been 450 days now. Oh. I suppose it's a bit late for him to evac at this point. Yeah. Speaking of uh, evacuation, why are you here? Lower floors are a nightmare these days. Who knows? It's too dangerous for human workers. Here, let me check your credentials. Uh. No disrespect intended, just protocol after all. Mm-hmm. Right. You're not an employee. You're an alien from an exoproximal, aren't you? Listen, I'm unarmed. Please don't kill me. Do they have the concept of mercy in your universe? Just stay calm, okay? Is that, is that security? Don't. I'm gonna go this way. Let's not head towards the guy calling for security. Although security all gone as well, perhaps? We can't go that way. So we will move this way instead. Oh, can I teleport over there, though? Of course I can. So there's a kinetic generator to our left. To our left. Oh, hello. Does it do anything? Does it freak out if it sees us? It does. It does. I should not have done that. Running away. Running away. Ping. Close the door. Okay. So we've made it to the kinetic generator. Ooh. Laser sword? Ah! 
Two of them. Oh, I love the way they break up as well. How many are there? Okay. So we have a locked door, a locked door, and a locked door. So I guess we will head... Can we jam this up again, I wonder? Seems unlikely. It's very unlikely. Can I swap hands? Oh, I can do... Ah, yes, perfect. I feel more comfortable hitting things with my right hand. That's my beating hand. There's a door there, and there's a locked door there, so... Ping! Hello? Oh, no voice for this guy. Finally got the shipment of janitorial drones from assembly, which means I'm out of a job. Ah, couldn't be happier, to be honest. Yay! Get to head over to the service for a few days early. It's about time too. the matter exchange events. Read, an ugly ass alien pops into our dimension and I have to mop it up once it's killed. I've been getting more and more frequent. How do I, how do I scroll down? Ah, just like that. Once every few weeks now, in our sector at least. I can't imagine what it'll be like after the reactor fully starts up. Glad I'm getting out of here early. One thing I'll miss is Brian. Ah, uh, One of the local scientists. He's a senile idiot that should not have access to Planck's technology, but he's a fun guy. Wonder what we up to after the evac. Might try to get a beer with him topside someday. Ah, uh, No, you won't. So, is that enough upgrade? It is not. So let's head, whoop, I do love that teleport. This entire game was done by a single guy. This is massively impressive. Really got to hand it to him. Now where? Have I missed something? So we can't go into Prowl's office. There's Plank's office. Did I miss a key card? That's what I, all I can assume. That I've missed a key card somewhere. Because neither of those want to open, and there's nothing down there we can get to. That felt dangerously close to the edge, didn't it? So let's check down. Whoop, 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 whoop. Down here again. Is there something I missed in here? No, it's just that. That door's still locked. Boop, boop. Oh, have I got stuck already? That didn't take very long, did it? Oh, hello. But I can't, I have to go to that one first. Is that what we're saying? Ah. Boom boom. Okay. Wasn't too hard. A little concerned I'd be immediately stuck and have to look it up like an idiot, but I'm not a complete idiot. Success. So security bots. Oh. The security bots are not very good shot. That guy's just shooting his friend. I don't think they've hit one yet, have they? Nope. They are terrible. They are terrible people. People? Terrible robots. Sentinels. Bots. Hello? Oh, that's my face. How dare you? Oh, I can kill the little things. Good. Is he dead? I don't think I can kill him. I think I can smack him about.
Well, they don't seem particularly dangerous, I suppose, do they? So that's a locked door. That guy's dead. Good afternoon, boys. Hello. Pete. Is that the guy in the phone? Please stop submitting minor complaints to administration. We know what working conditions are like, and we aren't going to change them. Well, that's pretty sucky. Uh, locked door. Ooh. Oh, I missed him. Ooh. Hello. Slap. How do they attack? Do they attack? Or am I just murdering completely defenseless aliens? Whoop. Oh, that's very handy. Yep, I uh, definitely just hit my light again. I definitely need to do something about that light. It hangs down way too low and it's way too easy to hit. I like the handles set higher up the uh, the walls. You've got something to grab onto and pull yourself up. A lot of VR games don't do that. And it's very frustrating. Oh my word, hello. Obviously, we've gone to the left first because that's how we roll. Oh! I assume we get better. Probably could have just teleported, couldn't we? Whoop. Oh, that's interesting. Down to the fire. Or up. Oh, we can't go up there. Okay. I suppose down to the fire. Let's take a look at upgrades. Do we want teleport range 2 or teleport speed? Ooh. Ooh, what do we want? Oh, lots of things. I like it. Um, hmm. Teleport speed, I think. Too soon. Oh, I was lucky there. Is this the time for a... Damn, elevator's working. Not working. Should have gone with the last pits run like I was supposed to. Now evac is over and I'm stuck in the vents. Oh, no Clive. <laughs> like his little picture. Trying to get to maintenance, but these things are like a maze. Lost one of my shoes in the air recycler. I feel like I'm dying of thirst. I think I'm lost. Doesn't sound great for you, does it? Can we swim? No, but we can walk through water. That'll do. That'll cool us down a little bit. There you go, the kids. There's a life lesson for you. Always look where you're going. Right, so let's do this without plummeting to our deaths, shall we? How does that sound? Sounds pretty good to me. We'll stick with the same route because, you know, always go left. That's the rules of the channel. Don't jump down there. I feel like that might not be... We're okay. Oh, I can't duck to go out. Oh, I can't duck to that stuff. It's a big old wind turbine. It's a big old wind turbine. There's a window there with a working elevator. So I guess that's where I'm heading. And I can't go down there. Can't go down there. Oh. Well, 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 well. That's two deaths in two minutes. Going good. Going good. Oh, it's back here. All the way back here, these seconds away from where I died. How dare you, game. I like that it shows your upgrade vial on the bottom of the uh, wand as well. So we will no longer... Oh, I was going to say we will no longer go down there, but we didn't go down there. We will no longer plummet to our deaths, maybe, is what, what I'm going for. 
So I came from there. Don't go down there. So I'm assuming we can go down there. It sounds like, yes, it's head back into... Let's do that. So we went that way. We came that way, so we'll go this way. Oh, dear. Uh, 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 uh. And that's taking us back here. So there's got to be something with this room. And I can see the vents down there, which I did originally think were what I was supposed to go for. Hmm. There's... Oh, I've got myself stuck. No, I'm okay. There is something I'm missing, isn't there? What am I missing? Is it that I have to go this way? Nope, that looks like death, doesn't it? That looks like death. And that one's death. Huh. Huh. Where are we going then? Is there a different route out of here I didn't pick up on? Not that I can see. We can't break these things with the radiation sign on them. Is it down there? No. Oh, well, now I am stuck. Well, that didn't take very long, did it? I could try just jumping down. Well, I did, and I landed on the platform, and I still died, so it's not that. Hmm. Interesting. So we can't... We probably could go that way, but we're not supposed to go that way. So there's nothing else here apart from the way we came in. Ah, what's up there? Oh. Give me that stuff. Is there more? Oh, I can't head up there. Ah, just for a second. Just for a second, I thought I'd cracked it. So this is after the... Nope, didn't mean to do that. Huh. Well, we'll have one more go, but I might have to call it there and then definitely not look it up before the next video. Because that would be cheating. Did it save? Nope. And I definitely can't go... Is that enough for an upgrade? It is enough for an upgrade. So am I supposed to get teleport range? Because it's giving me two chances to get it now. Now can I go somewhere here? Nope. What is going on, then? We'll take an extra look in this one, because I think this is the one we have... ...examined. Oh, I'll just go straight to there, though. We can't come back that way. So maybe we'll go back this way, and then we will... ...go in the rapid-fire fire one. Have an extra look there, but otherwise, I might be a wee bit stuck already. Again, I'm a terrible person. Time that badly. No, it's just nothing in there. Huh. Well. Well, well, well. So next time, we will figure out what on earth we're doing. And as I say, definitely not by looking it up, because that's cheating. There must be another route in... Somewhere. Obviously, he says. What an obvious statement. You fool. But I don't know where.
That's just there, and I can't go up there. Yeah, I don't know then. All right. Whoa, I thought I was right on that. Okay, well, we'll leave that there. Still really enjoyed the game. It just seems like it's been really interesting, really fun. Like I say, a little bit surreal and weird, and um, I love that. I love that. Again, a massive thank you to Indy. If you've enjoyed this, give it a like button, a little click. Why not? Massively appreciated, of course. Comment, subscribe, all those good things. And I will see you next time in Vertigo Remastered, which will hopefully finish before the next game is out. That's the plan. And as always, I love that as well. Thank you very much for joining me.